What's up guys, Doug Lane here, Fast Lane Car Care. Hey, I want to show you a, a quick trick. I showed you guys something like this uh, last week, a couple weeks ago, which I'm sure half of you won't see this in order. But anyway, um, these Jeeps, this is the 99. We'll save that for later, just in case. Uh, anyway, this is a 99, I'm pretty sure he told me. I normally don't work on stuff this old, but check this out so we got these seals which this one's kind of tight but then everything else man we can just you know we can especially the top edge we can really put some film up there so the the problem is you know obviously we don't have a border uh we're not going to take this apart because it's old i'm sure the plastic and stuff's brittle so how are we going to make sure that we get a good tight straight edge because this i mean has to be you know basically perfect because uh, there's not much room to tuck that way but yet still tuck all these other sides well i did the other side and it turned out uh perfect um so i didn't do it this way though but i figured this would be a great time to show you the sharpie trick okay so now we're gonna come across the bottom here all right perfect now we're gonna tuck it up in here and just try to do the best we can with that. All right. So I don't know if you can see, we got our pattern here. So if we cut that out perfectly, you know, will it work? Yeah, probably. But we know we have quite a bit of film on either side. Sorry, I'm not really, I didn't really prepare. It's kind of spur of the moment. So anyway. Let's go ahead and anchor our film. <coughs> that was the weirdest. Man, I hope you didn't see my reflection in that. Um, we're going to cut, I don't know if you can see, but we're going to cut slightly above that line. And slightly to the right of that line. See our line still intact. Let's just tear that away. <sighs> All right. We use our factory straight edge here. Now here's the thing. We know we can tuck that thing way down in here. So if we're a little bit too high on the top, oh well. So we're gonna do the same thing. We're just gonna cut on the bottom side just to give us a little more extra uh, you know, just a little extra. I want to tighten that up just a hair. And then, just like we would any other time, just round the corner, just because, you know, why not? Same way with here. Same way with here. Let's see if our pattern works. So let's see. a different try edge that I only use for cleaning but or platinum platinum easy reach uh, but whatever user fusion tuck it in there 
I'll just real quick just kind of run down this edge you can see we're not getting very much in there flush that out the bottom okay So the reason I don't work on this old stuff very often is because nine times out of 10, there's just tons of dust in it. A lot of times the seals are falling apart, all that good stuff. So I don't know if you can see I'm dropping that side in. I'm drop this side in. See how far I tuck that down in there? It's a little bit further than I wanna really tuck it, but it should be okay. So now we can shift it up, shift it back. Right there, everything's covered. We got a little bit of room if we want. We really, we could have cut it a little bit more loose, but I think this will do it. I'm just kind of being real gentle here. I don't want to push too hard, ended up shifting my pattern and then have it tack and be stuck where it's at. So, looks like that's pretty good. Just go ahead and kind of hard tool it down into the corner, I'll go up. There you go, now you've done Cherokee quarter windows the easy way. The big benefit is, with these anyway being factory tinted, um, if you do find yourself slightly short in a corner or something, you rounded it off a little bit too much, something like that, uh, you're not really gonna see it. I mean, it's, it's good to go. Um, 5% all the way around over top of the factory. We're doing five on the fronts uh, and a windshield strip. But uh, anyway, there's your quick little tip. Use a Sharpie. I'm obviously not gonna leave the glass like this. I still gotta do this window, uh, front windows. So all this will get cleaned. Um, but for now, there you go. Use a Sharpie, trace your edge, cut around on the outside. Thanks for watching.